Can we talk about the conflict, the Israel-Gaza conflict? You were very quick when the attack happened by Hamas to support Israel. Is your support still unequivocal? Let me be quite clear. The actions of uh, Hamas, a prescribed organization, were outrageous. It was a terrorist uh, act. We've seen over many, many years uh, the desperate plight of Palestinians living in uh, Gaza. We've seen since uh, October the 8th uh, the catastrophe of, in my view, uh, disproportionate force used by the Israeli government. I think it's collective punishment. What we need to do is to try and de-escalate the uh, violence. What, what the Israeli government should be doing is allowing food, water, electricity, essential medical supplies to reach the people of uh, Gaza. Uh, many of those people in uh, Gaza, particularly the children, uh, the women, uh, the men, weren't involved in the atrocities of uh, Hamas. And I do worry about the ripple effects of what's happened in the Middle East uh, affecting our city with an increase in anti-Semitism and an increase in Islamophobia as well. We can't allow what's happening in the Middle East to affect the streets of our city. Some Conservative MPs think you should ban pro-Palestine marches. Well, let me be quite clear about this, and I think Conservative MPs should understand what the law is. It's the Home Secretary. Only she has the power to ban any uh, marches. I'm quite clear, though, a cornerstone of our democracy, a cornerstone, is the right to protest. Uh, protest. Do these marches worry you? The protests that have to be peaceful, lawful and uh, safe. And so the police will be working incredibly hard again, as they always do this weekend, to make sure people have the right to protest. The right to protest does not mean the right to break the law. And so the police will be taking action if the law is broken. Should London open its doors to refugees from Gaza? Listen, we were brilliant in opening our doors to refugees from uh, Ukraine. I think we should be doing much more. I don't accept phrases like, inverted commas, hurricane of migrants. I think the government's been uh, abominable in the last 13 years in relation to creating a hostile environment. I'm really proud some of my best friends are, are refugees, the children of refugees. Would you welcome myself, refugees from Gaza? Uh, I think we should be providing a safe haven to all those fleeing persecution, including those who we know have problems in Gaza. My point is this, though. I think the people in Gaza don't want to leave Gaza. That's their home. They've seen the consequences of uh, displacement. What we should be doing as a country who is a close ally of Israel is saying to the government of Israel, please, 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 understand the consequences of the action in uh, uh, Gaza. You're in danger of uh, exacerbating uh, tensions there, but also another generation of young people uh, on, on both sides are, are going to grow up with less chance of there being peace. We, sh we should encourage those communities to move towards peace rather than what we've seen for the last 70 years.